What's up, gang? Big deal. Back at it again. Week 8. Suck my Pokeballs, Draft League. Um, We're playing on a short week here. It's, it's like Tuesday. And we... Um... And we um, just played on Sunday. So uh, our guys are a little tired. Um, didn't have a whole lot of time to rest. Short practice. Um, so we're doing a few of, well, really just one thing. One, one same thing from last week. Um, going up against McMeezy. Uh, the professional singles player. Um, let's see if he can translate that over to doubles. Uh, so far, so far he hasn't, unfortunately. Uh, but we'll see. Maybe tonight's the night. We're uh, still undefeated, seven and zero. Um. So yeah. <clears throat> We got the weakness policy, Ursa Luna, Orangaroo thing again. But everything else is slightly changed. It's normal Rillaboom. We got some cool Espeon stuff. Volbeat. And we got Throat Spray. Come up. Um, yeah, I don't know. This team here is a lot of setup, which I do like. I enjoy that. I think it's fun. Doing some like little neat stuff, but it does, could lose some tempo. And if I'm not careful, I can just get knocked out before I'm even able to finish setting up. <sighs> so what do we lead here? What does he have? So we got water or Saluna again. <clears throat> And he has iron, le uh, iron Leaves and Thunderous, which is just not that chill. Iron Leaves beats it either way. Vaporeon beats it in space. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tr try it because I'm actually running out of time here already somehow. Um, I don't know if he watched last week's video. Um... Unfortunately, I led it game one, so if he just watched like five minutes of it, he knows exactly what I did, and I'm doing the exact same thing here. So, if we see, yeah, that was a, that's a good, that's a good lead there. Fuck. And you know, with the speed boosting that time, that's solid. Um, okay. I wonder... I wonder if that, um... I'm just gonna do it just to get the speed boost on Rangor. I don't really like what I got going on here, but I I think I think Luna survives. Like, what does I think do? Oh, protect. Okay. Damn, I should have just should have set myself up. What's that? Dark pulse. Okay. Now I am citrus berry. It's supposed to be a symbiosis. Um. A little symbiosis deal. Um. To proc. The weakness policy on Ursa Luna. However, he hit the this thing first. Okay. So I think I'm gonna. No, it's even. I don't think I have to water. Water Terror does nothing here. So I'm gonna go. Do you think he he has to go into the Ursa Luna now, right? With a grass move, I assume. So I'm just gonna hyper voice protect. I think he's gonna go for like a what's that thing even get? Like Leaf Blade? 
Leaf Blade Dark Pulse again, so I'm just going to protect. I'm going to eat this Leaf Blade. Hopefully survive. He didn't get an attack boost, so I think I survive. Get the weakness policy. And we're going to try to double KO here with this um, Hyper Voice. What we got here? We got a Grass Terra? No. What is this? What's his deal? Dark Terra? He's trying to fucking... He's going for the KO here. Good thing I protected. He's going for the freaking jugular. Nice Terra. I like that. Air Slash? And he missed? Does this thing not have a... Is he expecting me to Terra? Is he expecting a Grass Terra on my end? Oh, no, dude. I want you to hit my policy. I want you to hit it, dog. Fuck. What did he do? He dark pulsed? I mean... I guess I'm gonna swap in Rilla here. Cause... Orangaroo's just gonna die. I like the boost that I have, but... Yeah, let's just swap in Rillaboom here and see what happens. Ooh, that wasn't thinking. If he goes for a big old grass move here, I'm gonna just boost it. Let's boost it with that grassy terrain. He might really do some. He might do some serious damage. And the air slash near the Rilla. Eat that though. Wait a minute, air slash. That's a I'm just now comprehending. Isn't Air Slash, uh, uh, special move? Is that a special, is that a special Iron Leaves? What the deuce? Does that thing even have good special attack? I have no idea. I've always assumed it is just physical. Um, can, I don't even know if he can hit this Ursaluna. Can he do any damage to me? I'm just gonna do this. Pick up a double KO here, I think. He's coming in. Charizard. Okay. Hyper Voice might kill. Will he finally do a grass move into Ursa Luna, please? Jesus, this guy's all over the place. Fleshy Terrain. Okay. That helped him out. I, I'm confused by his by his playstyle. Oh, be honest, I'm a little confused by your tactics. That Charizard is. What the hell was even that? How did that how did that do how did that do literally zero damage to that Charizard? What kind of monster is that? Alright, alright. Here's where we got some stuff. Um Water Terror is good here now. Now that that now that, that grass grass drawn's down. Um I wonder if he... What does that thing have? Close combat? I wonder if he's special too. I'm just, I want to protect. I want to see what he's building. And then I want to bring in... He's probably going to go for a Heat Wave, right? Should I Terra? I don't really want Terra. Heat Wave? Who can eat a Heat Wave? Kobo can maybe eat a Heat Wave. Kobo can't really eat an Air Slash though, so... Let's bring a Rangaroo back in. I don't know. Um, did I talk about my strategy? Yeah, I got a lot of setup. And another fun thing, I'm gonna hopefully I get to use it, is I have, so I have multiple setups with weakness policy, um, drain punch, okay. Weakness policy, what's the other, what's the other, what's the other dig I get? will o -Wiss. this is support Zard? I mean, I think it's bulky as hell. That's kind of neat. Um... I got the Clanging, Clangorous, Soul, Coma O, and I got Psych Up on the Espeon. So we got some, so we're, we're out here, you know, we're out here playing. Do I do that? That Charizard is something else. I think I take a Drain Punch just fine. And we'll go ahead and grab a Speed Boost again. 
I'm gonna do this in case he's sashed. Okay, I don't take that as fine as I really thought I would. Big damage. Let's see what this Charizard is doing. It's Life Orb. Okay, no sash. Going for the Guru. Yeah, I'll take this speed boost. Earth Power is going to get the knockout. Alright. So I'm a little low, but we got the speed of Rangaroo here. Uh, but unfort unfortunately, I just use Earth Power and not Hyper Voice. So I can't instruct a Hyper Voice onto that Charizard. Fuck. Porion. Cut. Mkai, what do we think? What are we thinking here? Should I go for the Terra now? Do I do I do it? Does that even help? I think it'll help. I guess I'll survive something, probably, right? Damn. That's hyper voice. That's water terra, hyper voice. And let me protect. Does he even go into the Orangaroo? I bet he does. I'm gonna protect. I don't know. Hopefully, just hopefully, Vaporeon is more bulky, I think. But he could just do like a max HP, max special attack spread. Which a scold here would still be not that chill. Hopefully, he doesn't double into the moon. Okay. That's good. That's good. I think he's just gonna scold right into the uh, blood moon. Double protect. Okay, this is perfect. Because I get my hyper voice set for my instruct. Good scouting though. Good scouting on the Terra. So I don't know what else he's got on that. I don't know what he could have. Just Ice Beam and Skull Protect. That's all. I don't know what else the hell do you run on that thing? Do I hyper voice or should I just go for the Blood Moon? Do you think two hyper voices kills that Vaporeon? I don't know how bulky that is. Plus two, two Hyper Voices. I'm going to be safe and just Blood Moon it. Actually, no, because I don't even know if I killed Char... I should kill Charizard. I hit that Charizard with one, right? So I'm at plus two, I should kill it. I think it... I don't want Blood Moon. I think two Hyper Voices is going to kill. Let's see about it. Let's see what we get. That's, that's perfect. Crook. Crooky. Corky. Nice. So two, that was good. Two Hyper Voices, see what he does. What's the Vaporizer doing? Scolding? You can, you can need that? Yeah. Yeah, we clean it up. Ursaluna clean it up out here. I love, I love this, this fast Orangaroo. Um, maybe one of these days, okay, this is a little scurry, some scurry shit. Maybe one of these days I'll, uh, <sighs> Thunderous has probably kills Ursa, Ursa Luna here, right? <sighs> I don't know that I want to let that happen. How fast? I wonder, I mean, you, you max speed Thunderous, right? Like, what do I just do? We're gonna see. I'm just gonna Hyper Voice. Instruct. Instruct would be useless if he, I'm just gonna Hyper Voice actually. I think I killed anyway. I'm gonna do this just in case. He protects. I'm pretty fucking sure. Damn, I should have instructed. Oh, okay. So still no way of knowing if my Orangaroo is faster than Judging by the protect, I'm, I don't know that he knows how fast could that, like what's he building here? No, I outspeed Charizard. 
I should be alive, yeah. Yeah, I, I did that move just in case he... I think Thunder is outspeeds Ursa Luna. All right? I was going to say, let's see if Orangaroo Ar outspeeds Thunderous. It does! Okay, he doesn't have a whole lot of speed at all. Um, yeah, he's not he's not running a whole lot of speed on his side. Damn, that Charizard is insane, dude. What is that? What are you? He kills Ursa Luna here, I assume. Hopefully he air slashes and misses or something. That'd be funny. What the hell is that? I can't believe how bulky that Charizard is. Wild Fairy. No. He's getting rid of the Instruct. The burn was going to kill me next turn. It's good to know that that's not a very fast Thunders. We get the kill here. Did, did Ursa Luna just kill his whole team? Oh, is that what just happened? That's pretty, that's pretty sick. I think it did. I think Ursa Luna just killed his entire team. That's neat. That's, uh... Um... He asked me about stats. Sorry, McNeezy. I, um... I don't really respond because I'm playing. And sometimes when I try to type, I accidentally, uh... Maybe I can reply without closing the camera. I have a hard time with this. Um... I don't, I don't want to mash the videos. Let me get this going. Video going sick. Um, yeah, I mean that was that was pretty cool. We had Ursa Luna just did his thing. What did he lead? He led he led the leaves and the thunders. I kind of want to do a coma o thing now. Kind of want to try this. Should I just go right into Espeon? He's got Dark Pulse. I don't really like that he has that. Um, let's you know Como Espeon or yes, let's try Como Como Espeon. We're just gonna we're gonna just gonna try to set up the a uh, um. A souls, a souls boost, and a psych up. That's what that's what we're going for here. Ooh. There's a Lucario case. This is fine for me. This is really ooh. I got Fairy Terra. I think he's gonna go for the same. Oh, I assume. Hmm. So we're gonna do this. I don't think Dark Pulse is gonna kill us, beyond unless he Terra's. I think I'm gonna do this, but he has a. What do we saw? He's physical, so he probably has. Does that thing get Bullet Punch? I think it does get Bullet Punch. I'm a little worried about the Lucario, but we're just gonna run this and see what happens. This is a good. This is a good coverage lead for him. Maybe he switches out Lucario. That'd be cool if he doesn't like this matchup. Alright, I think we're going to see a Dark Terror, Dark Pulse, and an Espeon. And I, I, I did Fairy Terror, right? Alright, good. Um... The freaking iron leaves being special is uh it's interesting. Drain punch. Damn dude. That thing's fucking strong. I don't like that guy. I really don't like him. Oh. What the hell? Did I bring the right espion? Um, 
I'm thinking one of these Pokemon that I brought is not right. Because... What have I done? This is not... Oh, this is the right one. What's that? Deuce? Oh my god. I thought I counted that speed, but uh, I guess I got confused and did it the wrong way. Yeah. Um, Como was supposed to be s slower than Espeon. That's funny. I'm glad that it's. I'm glad that I flinched. So I don't have a complete fucking retard, but you guys are gonna see on the video that I am a complete retard. Um, okay, well now we can just protect and psych up since I flinched. Let's see if he's got like a bullet punch or some shit. Oh fuck, if, I, if he does, he's gonna go right in there. Okay, good, good. What are you doing, Lucario? You killing the freaking Como? Bullet punch, poison jab. No poison, please. Alright. He still could have priority move. Extreme speed, he could be running. This is tough. This is a toughie. Yeah, this... I completely botched that speed. That's annoying. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work out good for me. Unless... Unless he doesn't have, there's no way he doesn't have extreme speed, right? There's no way that he doesn't have it. So who's he going into? Espeon, you think? I don't think, uh, Gumbo's not going to kill. I'm just going to do this. Um, he's going to extreme, no extreme speed. He, what the? I guess he doesn't have it. Alright. Focus Ash on him. Alright, we're gonna pick up the carry with Clangorus. Or no, Clanging Scales. Man. It's most interesting that he does not have extreme speed. The Iron Leaves, though, is scary because that does outspeed. It's also interesting to me that he has Poison Jab. I mean, I don't know Lucario's moveset off the top of my head, but I do know. I do know that. I mean, it should have a Steel move, right? Iron Head, something. But he has he's wearing Poison Jab. For some reason, Iron Head Stab would be more effective unless he's covering for like grass, trying to hit like Rillaboom as well. That might be what he's doing, just trying to have more coverage against my team. But I don't like that. I feel like people, I feel like people in these draft leagues make that mistake and they try to put coverage on. Um, oh my God, I live that. That's insane. I mean, no offense, but that's why you don't run physical Iron Leaves. I kind of wish that my Espeon died. I mean, that, uh. Actually, I'm okay with this because Espeon has speeds. So, that Iron Leaves is gonna be able to kill something. Hopefully. I don't think this kills. Like, Iron Leaves is gonna be able to kill something. Maybe, actually. I don't even know if it kills Espeon. We got the boosts. Um, does Dazzling Gleam... I'm going to Steward Power here, because I don't think Dazzling Gleam kills. And he's kill he doesn't even kill Espeon. Dog. Yeah. Sorry, McMeezy. Um, but Special Iron Leaves is not it. Special Iron Leaves. I mean, like, that's probably a roll. I landed at 1 HP. That's super unfortunate for you. Uh, but, yeah. 
But anyway, back to what I was saying. Um, I don't like putting coverage moves on everything. I think that's that's not necessary. You're better off just like you, you can add a few coverage moves here and there, but like your stab moves. You want stab, and you want um, like protects and stuff if you can afford it. Like that kind of stuff is really good. Um, slapping a coverage move on everything just. This is not going to be that effective. I don't really know. I wonder if that's like a scarf. That's probably scarf um, earthquake right here. All right, scarf earthquake and get the double KO. Um, did I just protect? No, I just I did not protect. So I'm gonna swap out in the Rillaboom. And I'm gonna protect. Get, I'm gonna get another leftovers tick. And actually, I'm actually going to have the grassy glide under that, um, on that crocodile. And this grassy terrain is also going to weaken the effect of Earthquake. I'm going to get our lefty stick, grassy glide. He's either going to, I'm pretty, I think he's going to be choice scarf. No, he's not. Okay. I mean, I think I said, that's, I might have said Sash a minute ago. I meant, I meant scarf. Rock slide. He's got some really unique sets. Um, really unique sets here. <clears throat> but. Yeah. Physical Charizard, special Iron Leaves. He's pulling out all the stops. Um, but I'm sorry again. I'm not going to really cut it. Let's see if, um, what am I at? Plus, plus six with two special attacks stored power. This is big damage here. And we Oko the bulky Zard. I mean, this was, this was a fantastic outing by me. Um, not to sound like a douchebag. Um, but yeah, he, Big Measy went for a long shot there. Doing some real unique sets, trying to throw me off. Um, but unfortunately, it was just a little, little too over the top. We cleaned up pretty good. Um, I think we lost one mon that whole fight. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry to do it to you guys. Um, I don't mean to be the bully of the, of the league. Uh, you guys want tips, right? I mean, I'm a little busy. Um... A lot of the times, but I'll try to help you out. I'll try to help you out with some builds, give you some ideas. But, um, babe, still in the video. If you like what you see here, if you like the coaching, I can help you. That's what I want to do. I want to help you guys. I want to help you guys. So maybe this can be a little more competitive. Sorry. Um, but anyway, for all you guys who are still here, thanks for watching. Absolutely dominating, uh, dominant victory. Uh, moving me to 8-0 next week. Next, next week is a highly anticipated match against Steven Manbeast. You know, things are getting a little heated between Steven and I. Um, I know he still got it out for me for coming in late last season and taking the title from him. Sorry, Steven. Uh, can you get your revenge? I know you're going to try. It's going to be a good one. Don't miss it. See you guys.